How many hours have you spent manually fixing deformed or uneven meshes in Blender? Only to end up frustrated. What if I told you there is a hidden technique that can save you all that time and efforts? Meet the Laplacian modifier, your secret weapon for mesh smoothing or deformation control. Stick around and I'll show you why this underutilized tool can re revolutionize your workflow. So, okay, let's take a example how to use the Laplacian modifier and how it works. So here we have a general environment of our blender. So let's uh, talk about how it's work, how the Laplacian modifier work. For this I want to scale it on Z axis. Okay, I want to control this. I want to def deform like here is our controller and I move and then it deform like this curve. Okay, now let's jump to the edit mode and create some loop cuts okay make it like okay now go to the object mode with the select this uh, cube go to the modifier and add Laplacian modifier and suddenly you can see that here is some setting of our Laplacian deform modifier one is repeat and anchor weights actually Laplacian deform modif needs a vertex group and anchor weights to work ok let's create a vertex group go to the edit mode let's create go to uh, select this faces this vertices and uh, okay let's uh, jump to the wireframe mode front view okay let's select these verses these verses and these verses go to the object data property mode and create a group and assign okay deselect and select to recheck the okay go to the viewport shading mode and with the select this go to the modify tab and select that group we create here and bind and you can now you can see if I jump to the edit mode ok let's uh, check this ok let's select this and now grab this one you can see let's select this ok go to the object mode now you can see it deforms our mesh like a smooth uh, curve so this is uh, the main purpose of our uh, Laplacian deform modifier it actually uh, work on vertex group you can create vertex group and you can deform your mesh by dragging these vertices you create in group the Laplacian modifier not only saves time but also ensures precision in your work now if you found this tutorial helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more blender tips and tricks and let me know in the comments what the one blender modifier you cannot live without let's keep in the conversation going on